Hello everyone and welcome to the third video of my Python Basics tutorial series. If you haven't seen the previous episodes then go and check them out, the playlist link is in the description. Today we will be learning about arithmetic operators. Now what are arithmetic operators? Well they are used with numbers to do math operations. Ok let's go through the different operations you can do. So first thing you want to do is open up idle. What you want to do is go to File, New File, or hit Ctrl N, it's the same thing. So first off, there is Addition. So we do this using a plus sign. So let's make two variables like we learned in the last episode. Let's just call one x equals, I don't know, 21, y equals 5. And then we can do print x plus y. Save it. And if we go to run, run module, we get 26 because 21 plus 5 is 26. Now there's subtraction. We can do it exactly the same as how we did addition, apart from we can use a minus sign. So we can save it, run, run module 16 because 21 minus 5 is 16. Multiplication and division are the same as well. So we can just use an asterisk um, with instead of a minus sign, run it. 21 times 5 is 105. Now if we divide, we can use a slash for the division symbol. Run, run module 4.2 cos 21 divided by 5 is 4.2. There's also modulus. This is less common but is useful in some situations. Modulus is used to find the remainder of division. It's done with a percentage sign, so if we do, uh, I don't know, let's change x to 20 and y to 6, we can do x modulus using a percentage sign, y, and we will get 2 because 20 divided by 6 is 3 and we get a remained 2. We also have indices, also known as powers. This is done by two asterisks in succession, so uh, we can do... Let's just change this to 2 to 3. So, we can... This is um, how, do, how we do powers. So, 2 to the power of 3, 2 cubed, run it. We get 8, because 2 times 2 times 2 is 8. And finally we have floor division. Floor division is just division, but it rounds the result down to the nearest whole number. So if we do change x to 15 and y to 2, we do, we do floor division with two slashes. Save it, run it. We can see we get 7, because 15 divided by 2 is 7.5 and we get 7 because it rounds it down. Now for some challenges for you to do by yourself. As you know, I will be giving the solutions in a later video. So firstly, make a program that adds together two float variables, not integers, floats, which are decimal numbers. And make a program that adds together two float variables and then the result is to the fourth power. Make a program that gets the remainder of two float variables, then the result is floor divided by a number of your choice. So that's all for today guys, make sure to stay tuned for the next tutorial by subscribing and hitting the bell so you won't miss the next episode. Also drop a like if this helped you out, it helps me out a lot. If you have any questions about Python or need some help with any errors, be sure to leave it in the comment section below, I'll be sure to help you out. Any suggestions or feedback will be greatly appreciated as well. Thanks for watching.